This little guy is a panther chameleon, native to the island of Madagascar. Since they were first classified in the 19th century, science has grouped all panther chameleons into one species until now. The chameleon's coloration was known to vary widely according to where on the island it was found, but new DNA testing suggests the different colorations actually represent different species, 11 of them to be precise. But the researchers' discovery goes beyond clarifying the chameleon's taxonomy. It's about preserving Madagascar's rainforests. Madagascar has one of the most biodiverse ecosystems in the world, with a wide range of animals that can only be found there, most famously the lemurs. If the chameleons really are 11 different species, they characterize this diversity, because each is found only in certain parts of the Malagasy rainforest. That rainforest faces the threat of deforestation, and while it's hard to measure, some estimates say as much as half of the island's forests have been felled since the 1950s, resulting in the extinction of nearly 10% of the island's species. But that deforestation doesn't exist in a vacuum. It's driven by Madagascar's overwhelming poverty, with close to 70% of the country's 22 million people living in poverty as of 2012. Some 80% of the country's population lives on subsistence farming, and that often means slash and burn agriculture, which can be devastating to the rainforest. So in the face of all that, what can a chameleon do? Well, chameleons are what the scientific community calls charismatic. While not everyone would agree they're cute, even though they clearly are, they do stick with you, and as such, could help raise awareness of their rainforest's precarious position. For Newsy, I'm Sebastian Martinez.